news for the movie industry. Very good news for sci-fi fans. A new, potentially new, fran- maybe even a franchise. Director of Gareth Edwards' new sci-fi cr- film, The Creator, was recently screened. And first reactions are very positive. Very positive. Mm-hmm. Jenna Man, knows how to do sci-fi. Uh, is a masterpiece of an AI story. It had me in tears. Watching a film about no maybe hollywood won't want maybe this will make make you so empathetic to ai that hollywood's like give them what they want that was the plan Wait. all along yeah we don't want to strike anymore just it's give AI. Well, this, i mean this movie was what, the, i mean the, the movie save was save the ai children i mean the movie oh, was made way before Stop the your AI. strike <laughs> save the AI, ai children what if these ai <laughs> scripts took the form of a child yeah we need to like form like a sound of freedom like like a fan base. Well, no, we this. don't. Not, <laughs> no, we don't. <laughs> it's like AI. Right? What, the AI what, children. what if the AI children that are script AI? Why do you hate AI children? Bro? A human child. Would you want Disney not to sign them into the contract? <laughs> On a serious note, I wasn't I mean, impressed with these trailers. The, that's the movie. Is is there something to destroy the AI and it's a child and then it then it then the person that's sent. It's almost like Decker from. Blade Runner, they're sent to you know, or Decker Port of Call. Yeah, <laughs> Voltaire gets it. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, I, I was whatever about the trailer. Like I wasn't like think, seeing anything that's very like crazy. Like I was gonna wait in digital probably. About you. But these reviews, like I have seen awesome reviews, and I was like, damn, I'm actually shocked. So probably, Gareth this probably Edwards shot one. beautiful film. John David Washington deserves to be recognized during award season. Really, damn. I don't think- who is this person? Letter. According to Jenna Bush Henderson. Okay. Oh my. She's got a hyphenated name. I should say something about her. Drew Taylor. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> the soulfulness and spirituality of Gareth Edwards, the creator, make every go for broke action set piece, even generally dazzling visual effects by ILM. He's really good with effects. Every he did all his own effects for monsters resonate that much more beautifully designed and shot and richly rewarding. I Go like his chase sequences too. Good man knows how to shoot sci-fi. He really does. Yeah, Joshua Terry, like Terry, the creator is a fresh take on AI versus humanity <clears throat> subgenre of sci-fi cinema. It's gripping, thought-provoking, and filled with amazing performances. Really, damn! I didn't Ray get that Ray at all from the trailer. Gareth Edwards have once again outdone themselves with the cinematography. See it on the biggest screen possible. How can you Holy say that, Burke, when you see this image? That looks amazing. No, the images do look did look good, but I'm just saying from the story aspect, I, I did I, I I wasn't like I didn't get any good lines or nothing. It was just like I was I felt it was very bland personally, um, but outside of the visuals, it, and yeah. I love the vid- I think Rogue One is best the best. As much look as I don't that like that movie, visual. I think visual, yeah, visually, it's the best. Rogue, look Rogue One is literally a beautiful shot movie. Yeah, yeah. and it's made it by. It has the like the perfect Star Wars look. Gareth oh, Edwards oh, doesn't miss with the creator. The movie takes place alongside Terminator Two: Alien Star Wars. <laughs> is absolute F- smashing example of how sci-fi is crazy. World. Holy, this is blowing me away. The best films of the year. Oh, wow. Well, who said our oh, shit? Yeah, that was my girlfriend. I no, that was me. <laughs> oh shit! This sounds great. <laughs> She's playing me. Overwatch. Sorry. No. Oh, he's not disappointing your girlfriend. Hold on to that one, Perp. Hold on to that one. Yeah. I'm. I'm actually floored, man. Good. For, like, have you guys ever seen Monsters? His first movie. If you watch the making of that, like he did all the effects in his bathtub. Like, like that's like, amazing. He's really good with effects. So it's like he gets to work with a team of this, with guys like that. Uh, oh, man. I mean, yeah. from the I mean, from the trailer, I was like, it looks great, and yeah, from every review, I wasn't impressed with the trailer, but I'm, I'm, I, like, honestly, like, yeah, there's plenty of trailers I didn't like, and I was like, damn, those movies, like, a lot of the Marvel trailers, I think they're kind of bad, but then the movies end up being great till recent, till Thor Ragnarok. Uh, for like so, this, this I mean, great, for yeah. a budget of eighty million, is good, and million. it's very good for a sci-fi movie. So, you know. yeah, I'm I mean, seeing it day one. This is great. day one now. These reviews got me. Reviews matter yeah. to me. Yeah. These are heavy. I mean, yeah, I was iffy on Gareth Edwards before. The only thing I like really enjoyed from him was Godzilla. But like, mm-hmm. you know, Me too. Hear, hear these reviews though, like, our, and our, I did like the trailer. It did look really cool. So. I don't know any of these people though, but I'm excited uh, to see true. this now. Opening Anthony, weekend, the movie podcast. The creator encapsulates the spirit of '80s anime and translates it to a mesmerizing live action cinema. Think Akira meets Spielberg. <laughs> Jesus, Jesus. 
That's a high, geez, that's a high bar. While the lore could be dense, the stunning visuals and immersed atmosphere have us eager for more tales from this visionary universe. All caps. Visionary universe. Visionary oh, wow. Universe. Gotham Geek Girl. It's a good if name. she's on board, I am. I don't know who she is. <laughs> the creator okay. is a tantalizing, beautiful cinematic display that takes a different approach and stands to the kinship of AI. John David Washington gives a solid performance as Joshua, the special agent who battles with his beliefs and has a strong connection with Voilus. Hmm. Simon Thompson, the creator, is breathtaking in scale and vision, very emotional, much more than anticipated. It's ambition, ambitious and mostly hits the targets it shoots for. John David Washington turns in an engaging performance, a blend of strength and empathy. It should be seen on the big screen. The creator's astonishingly good. Best film of the year and best sci-fi. What are, the are hell? people trying to get noticed or something? That's what I'm saying. Click on one of these people. See what else they talk about. Hey, right? Justin. No. I mean, that's what they think about, about the, the creator good reviews. The creators. I mean, creator that's what people think something. about the movie. There's nothing yeah. wrong with that. You know. I yeah. love Rogue One. Uh, I hope oh. so. I hope it doesn't get overhyped. For me. Yeah, this is kind I'm of getting me it. overhyped. This is a lot of hype. Yeah. The creator is astonishingly good. Best film of the year and best sci-fi film in ages, in my opinion. So it's being compared Brandon to Star Dave, Wars. This person before, and they got a blue check mark. Yeah, but these are people who got pre-screening, right? Yeah. Gareth Edwards flips expectations really impressively for a visceral, touching, and creative story. If you has Grace reviewed it yet? I think That's so. Awesome. Yeah, I think so. The creator awesome. is a masterful piece of original sci-fi. Gareth Edwards is one of the great, if one of our great filmmakers, a soulful, nuanced, Lucas-like interrogation on human beliefs, biases, and our insecurity in the well, face. Oh yeah, she's in. She interviewed the director yesterday. Hell? Yeah. Uh, Ooh, great master. yeah oh my god she's Mama's officially geeky. access media mama's geeky not only is the creator visually stunning the story is really emotional too i was completely captivated captivated, captivated. pretty early on elfie is adorable i totally fell in love with her she loves ai hollywood cancel this lady all right i'm not reading them all i'm seeing if there's any are you there. sure because it looks like you are no i wasn't reading them all well that's Oh my god, yeah, there's a, that's a, that's a damn. I'm, I'm actually really hyped, man. That's Max awesome. Grace did a six minute interview with uh Gareth Edwards on her channel. So, if you're interested, okay, cool, cool. Uh, I might react to that later mm -hmm. off, off stream. Thank Probably you. Probably gonna for... be very fluffy. What do you mean? She does a good interview, yeah, but uh, yeah. oh no, I'm sure it's fine. It's here. Yeah, remember to thumbs up the video, see.